I want to give you two quick updates today on the missions moment. One is the trip to Denmark, and one is uh, the, the, uh, just an update on the situation in Lesotho. So as far as Denmark, it went really well. I told you all last week I was going to lead some discussion on a, with a tool I developed. And I can't say too much because discussions are ongoing. What I can say is it identified some things. Um, people found it very helpful, and it's created more work because they decided they want to go deeper. So we were just doing a kind of a 30,000-foot view to see if there were needs to go deeper with this tool. And they all agreed yes, so in May we're going back <laughs> down to Germany this time to continue and look deeper with this. So I, I feel positive that what I brought was useful, um, but it also has then created more work because we realized, hey, there are some things we need to be looking into. But overall, it's, it's a positive thing for the IBC because the goal of the IBC is to, well, we say mobilize and multiply disciple-making churches, and the leadership is there to help us be more effective, all of our churches. And so what I was doing with the executive team this week was to help them to reorient their thinking and to say, hey, what do we need to adjust so that we can better do what we're called to do? And um, so thank you for your prayers, and we'll continue to see how this develops, and hopefully the months ahead I'll have more updates as some things come together a little bit more solidly. As far as Lesotho, in three weeks I should be there, or it should be at least three weeks from now exactly at this time, I should be driving somewhere between Joburg and, and Vepiner. What's really exciting is just see how God brings these things together and all the details. So while this trip has already been set for a while, we just found out this week that the founders of Out of the Bowl Africa are going to be in Cape Town while I'm in South Africa. Now they're gonna be there a day before I was gonna be in Cape Town, so now we're having to readjust our schedules. But these are the found, this organization is the one that has helped us feed almost a million people in the last couple of years. Now what they're saying is they want to establish a base of operations in Vepiner to not only serve the Free State, which is one of the states of South Africa if you're not familiar, but also Lesotho. Now remember, the whole purpose of the trip that I'm taking is to go down to Lesotho and investigate how we can do more to help Lesotho both in physical ways as well as spiritually. We've been invited in by the Prime Minister to come and explore what more we can do in addition to what we're already doing. So now, Out of the Ball has said we want to establish a base in Vepiner that will serve into Lesotho, and they have a goal, what I'm hearing, is they have a goal of a million people being fed every day. So, I mean, this is huge, and again, God's worked it out that they're actually, they, they live in Orlando, the founders, that they're actually going to be in Cape Town the same time I'm in South Africa, so I've been asked to readjust so I can go meet with them and we can discuss this strategic partnership. So, it just seems like God's bringing it all together, some really cool things happening there. So, appreciate your continued prayers. There are still some kinks to work out with travel, with COVID. There's some, still some restrictions that we're praying are going to be dropped in the next few weeks because they need to be for everything to happen the way that it's, it's planned out. But we're moving forward in faith that God has called us to this and he has a plan and it's going to work out because we, we just see him pre preparing those steps. So we know that even though we see walls in front of us, those walls are going to fall down before we get there. But we do want to continue praying into that. So let's pray now as our, our team comes back up. And uh, we are not going to pass an offering again today just because we'll continue for another week or two until we're, we feel totally through this. But as always, you can give online. I think Insung will put the slide up. Um, and we always appreciate, if you, and if you don't have the slide, you can see it in the bulletin. There's the um, account number. We always appreciate giving um, just through the, directly through the bank account. You can give both to the general account uh, as well as the missions account. Now, some of our general money also goes to missions, but so the general account helps us fund all the work we're doing, and the mission specifically goes to things like the work we're going to begin doing in Lesotho, the work we're doing in Malawi, and so forth. All right, let's pray, and then we will return to worshiping through music. If you want to stand with me as we pray. God, we just thank you so much for all the things we see you're doing, and even in the midst of the, in the, midst of the storm, in the midst of people around us getting sick and, and us seeing that there's plenty of struggles and yet at the same time, we see your hand in it. And so, God, we want to be uh, like the disciples, not in being afraid, but when they reached out and called to you to calm the storm. And God, we know that if you've called us out on the water, that you're the one that's going to provide the way. And so we do pray for both of these things, the work with the IBC. We thank you for productive meetings. We pray, God, that we continue to see that shape up in positive ways. 
Um, but then especially with this in Lesotho and South Africa, Father, we, we see your hand in it. We see the, the plans coming together in ways that we could have never worked out ourselves. And, and so, God, we trust that you're providing the way this will all work out. At the same time, we see the earthly barriers, certain government restrictions, Father, and we just pray that all these things will fall into place and we won't have any problems. We'll be able to smoothly carry these things out, that your will might be done on earth as it is in heaven, and that many people might come to know you as a result of the, the work we're doing. We pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you.